Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. Today I'm going to make a file handle. Now I'm not going to turn on the lathe and I'm not going to cast it out of steel. I'm going to make it out of pop bottle caps. Watch it, I'll show you how I did. Okay, I heated it up, formed it into shape, put a hole down the center. Still plenty hot though. Makes pretty good insulation. Putting it in the water has got to cool it off though. As it cools, it shrinks, grips tighter onto the file. Still plenty warm to hang on to. Not bad for a first attempt. Plenty solid too. Does a nice job as a file handle. Hang on, this one's bent, so I'm going to straighten it out. This is part of that Pandora's box stash. Ah, just broke off the tail of the file, but I don't think it'll matter. Nope, that goes right in there, holds on well. That's pretty cool. You know, I think if I made up a, a little mold, I could heat this stuff up, put the file in there, and then just squish the mold around it and let it cool. But even so, just working it up by hand. Just pop bottle caps. That's pretty nice. Yeah, it's still a little too hot to grab barehanded. It holds heat quite a long time. 
That's pretty cool. Well, that's a quick trick that I learned on the internet. Uh, there's lots of places that show you how to do this. I just never thought of actually using pop bottle caps for anything other than top of a pop bottle. Works pretty cool. I used a heat gun. This is a master heat gun. Uh, this one is, uh, it's got a range of up to 500 degrees. So, obviously 500 degrees is more than enough to do the job. Because I had it down to the point where it was starting to get uh, pretty fluid. Cool stuff. If you have any suggestions for a new video, questions about today's video, or any of the other videos on the channel, just drop a note in the comments below. You know, I read them all. And I'm going to be making some file handles. Lord knows I got a lot of files. <laughs>